Hello, awesome readers. Today we're going to be reading The Night Before Second Grade by Natasha Wing. Twas the night before second grade. I was out with my friend. We couldn't believe summer vacation had come to an end. But we were so excited and ready for school, even if it meant no more trips to the pool. All through the summer, I read so many books about castles, dinosaurs, and pirates with hooks. But in second grade, this is the first time I'll read chapter books and long poems in rhyme. Jack thinks I'll have it much too easy this year. Piece of cake, he said. You have nothing to fear. I'm not sure, I told Jack. I heard our teacher is tough, though I'm hoping he'll help us learn all kinds of new stuff. Like inches and angles, addition, subtraction, multiplication, and even some fractions. I can already count from one to one hundred and back. My dad always says I'm a real brainiac. Mom had taken me shopping for sneakers and jeans. My legs have grown long like skinny string beans. I picked out markers and notebooks plus a brand new backpack. Mom bought little boxes of my favorite snack. My backpack was hung on a coat hook with care with my school spirit t-shirt that I can't wait to wear. That night, I nestled all snug in my bed, while visions of chapter books danced in my head. Time to go, you two. Got everything, Nate? Dad was starting a new job, and he couldn't be late. Mom dropped me off in front of the school. Hey, look! All my friends are back together. How cool! Each of us was wearing our school spirit t-shirts. Check out our new shoes. We've all had growth spurts. I was kind of nervous about going to class. It's going to be weird, I told my friend Cass. Still, I couldn't wait to start the first day. When the bell ringed, I was on my way. Where is our teacher? I thought to myself. Then in he came as I put all my stuff on my shelf. When what to the class's amazed eyes should appear but my dad in his school spirit t-shirt. He was grinning ear to ear. I'm your teacher, said dad. You can call me Mr. Lee. Especially you, he joked, pointing directly at me. Dad let our class know that even though I'm his son, he won't play favorites. He'll be fair to everyone. I'm glad second grade is finally here. With Dad as my teacher, it'll be an interesting year. The end. Thank you so much for reading with me. If you enjoyed, please don't forget to like and subscribe so that we can read together again.